is an initiative that aims to foster a safe and healthy community with a particular focus on the culturally and linguistically diverse community. Hello, we're Manny Wilco from Star 104.5 and it's Stay Safe at the Beach Day. We're uh, live at Avoca Beach Surf Club. So it's about staying safe and not falling off the rocks and it's about teaching multicultural groups who may not know this kind of environment how to stay safe when they go swimming this summer. Over the last few years, rock fishing has been one of the biggest issues we've seen on the New South Wales coast. And we know that over uh, almost 83% of those who have drowned have been from Chinese, Vietnamese and Korean populations. I'm Dave Grant and I'm from uh, New South Wales Fisheries in their education volunteering section and we're here today uh, basically to spread the word on how to successfully go uh, rock fishing. It's, it's great really to have uh, council, uh, or both councils and all of the supporters put on days like today to make sure that all of our community and particularly those who come from other countries understand the safety we really do need to have on our beaches. So it's important that we teach all of this basic surf safety and coastal awareness to these groups because they are the groups that are coming down to the coast and we know they're the groups that are getting into trouble. Hey, I'm Will Anadu, I'm a Wyong Council lifeguard. I'm attending the safe day at the beach today and we've been doing some talks with our um, groups from the TAFE course who are English is their second language. So we've been up there giving them some good information on what to do at the beach and how to have a good fun and a safe day at the beach. Hi, my name is Dave Hill and I'm a team leader with Gosser City Council Lifeguard Service and uh, mainly what we're doing here is just showing people um, the dangers that you can encounter when you come to the beach, how to get out of those dangers, how to stay safe. We've got Dr Rob Brander that's come down and what he's doing today is throwing dye into the water showing the people that we've got up here today how the currents move around by the dye dispersing throughout the water. I'm Dr. Rob Brander and I'm a surf scientist from the University of New South Wales. And I'm here at Avoca Beach today and I'll be focusing on things like rip currents. What are they? What do they look like? What should you do if you get stuck in them? I'll talk about the waves we get in the ocean. How are they formed? What are the different types of waves? And which waves are more safer than others? Whilst the focus of the Stay Safe at the Beach Day is on beach safety, we have designed the day to engage the participants by incorporating plenty of fun activity. In this wonderful country we have with superb beaches, but lots of people come from all over the world to experience Australia and sometimes they don't know so much about safety. A multicultural community uh, to learn about Australia and the differences we have out here. And one of our greatest natural assets, of course, is our beach. But they've got to know about the safety, about coming to the beach, the difficulties that can arise. And when they have a problem, how do they ask for help? How do they recognise the problems before they go out there swimming? Who do they look to for assistance? So a day like today's giving them that education. If you're a local and you see somebody who doesn't look like they know what they're doing at our beach, make their experience of visiting the Central Coast great by giving them a bit of advice about how to stay safe at the beach. Well, what a great day, Stay Safe at the Beach 2011 was again. We'd just like to thank our sponsors for the day and our partners, Gosford City Council, Wyong Shire Council, Centrelink, Northern Settlement Services and Surf Life Saving New South Wales. We'd also like to thank our other organisations that assisted on the day and all of the staff that were involved.